Hello Capricorn, welcome to your reading a week ahead. A happy lunar eclipse as of today. So let's see what this uh, very potent energy has for you. Um, yes, let's have a look. Collective reading, dolphin and lamb. It's a beautiful, beautiful energy. Capricorn, if you are very shy at the moment with a new encounter or a recently start a friendship but this friendship is turning to be something more romantic i have to say that this is a very beautiful energy for you and this you know romantic encounter or a friend um you're very very admired you are admired for your simplicity for your charm for your shy approach they just love you they just adore you they want you know to hold you and really protect you and i feel that this uh energy as well is very light very refreshing you have never kind of felt like this you feel like burden free from all the past um all the past uh, toxic relationships that you had before this connection is very different and you feel as well quite um telepathically connected i think the lamp airs you see how um how big they are it seems like you are hearing them because dolphin is really communicating you know telepathically and it feels that you are hearing their music, their sirens, their their noise, you know, whatever, you know, they are com communicating to you um, with their mind or when they are thinking about you. It's like you both at the same time might, you know, uh, call to each other, text, and it's just a very, very strong connection. That's what I'm getting for you, my dear Capricorn. Let's have a look at what the tarot has for you to clarify this connection. I feel it's a very significant a step towards a very beautiful relationship. So let's have a look. We have King of Wands. We have Seven of Swords. We have Seven of Cups. And we have uh, Ace of Pentacles. Well, in the past, I think you had um, had some worries about this connection. I think you were really uh, slightly disappointed because certain things, the communication or the way they have projected uh, themselves towards you, it's it wasn't very emotional. It wasn't very... I would say emotionally fulfilling it was more practical more um something that really put you off you know something that you you thought that it will not will turn you know in the way that you will like you kind of were probably at that level that I need to walk away and I just need to find a way how to get out of this relationship because it just seems that this person is really doesn't understand me that they really are focused about themselves maybe you have seen some ego selfishness maybe a narcissistic uh, approach um, maybe they were really talking about the day-to-day -day activities like a routine things their intentions what they are building for their future and that was not what you have seeked really and you felt maybe emotionally um like someone you know stole uh, emotions from you someone stole from you a desire to be happy and maybe you have had the plans and imagine you know certain things what you could have with them and you know they just kind of left you in this disappointment and now things are changing wheel of fortune the high priestess the star and six of um swords so for me really speaking that you're moving away from this disconnect you're moving away from those assumptions that you had um also we're speaking that it could be that one person that you really really um uh, haven't even imagined that your um shift with this person could be in this way that they could be very spiritual that they could be very for emotionally fulfilling you and you just are mesmerized with the fact that you have 
a very strong spiritual connection. The higher, higher priestess really speaks about intuition. Maybe you feel intuitively their presence very strongly and this could be equally the same thing for them. So you are very surprised what is going on and and you are like, am I ready you know, to move on from what I have experienced with them? Because uh, it seems that they are playing... Um, they are playing, you know, in a way that you don't recognize is something that you haven't seen in their behavior before. And this is a very nice surprise for you. So let's see what, what the um, fairy cards has for you. We have the messenger. We have the queen of passage. We have the lady of forest. And we have the queen of golden bowl. So for me, this message is that someone came with some strong message. Um, the day behavior was not really uh, acceptable for you because they, I think they had, um, I would say, a message from the past. Someone that really um, twist their mind what they should do about you. Um, and in general about you know this new uh, relationship because i feel that this relationship that you are in is very fresh it's kind of still quite new and they are making the change they are communicating to you and they're communicating to you in a way that you feel very uh surprised emotionally it touches your heart and you feel like being blessed by something that you always desired you always desired to hear you know those soft and gentle words you always desired to be loved and these words really touches you to very deep level um and that is you know your and this another person's you know blessings because you both are um emotionally opening up for each other my dear capricorn so I feel that you will be closing through this lunar eclipse the doors for something, for a behavior um, of the partners that was not acceptable and that you kind of, you know, were already like done and dusted. Uh, that's it, you know, I don't really need um, this uh, crappy relationship. But suddenly, you know, this behavior is changing. They are changing their approach towards you. They really want a unity with you, you see, and they want, you know, to be really wild. They want to celebrate. They want, you know, to recognize. I think it will be very much a proposal for you to go um, maybe to meet their friends, maybe like um, allow me to introduce you to my friends, allow me to celebrate together with you um, this change, you know, maybe you are being officially uh ask to become their partner maybe it's an engagement um kind of you know uh, a news but also this is a awakening um very deep awakening that they realize if they will not use this opportunity to communicate to you about this strong union they will miss a chance of having someone as a very solid partner in their life so that's what i'm getting for you uh capricorn i hope um this message uh resonates and i will see you next week take care bye bye